Look at this flight path, guys. 8 minutes and 17 seconds. So, to distract ourselves while doing this, let's watch some hardcore deaths, alright? I have this already opened. Let's just, uh... This is gonna sound toxic. Laugh at other people losing their characters. Um, pretty toxic, right? Anyways, so... Here we have... Wait, okay, I... I is this guy actually charging with 173 health as a warrior into three murlocs? I mean, dude, there's no way you can deal with that. Like, he doesn't even have a health potion. Why not? You want to see why not? Let's see why not. Don't pull the other two. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh my god, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Now am I not fucking dead? Holy shit. Oh well. <laughs> that was fucked. That's just laughing. He doesn't care. Charge three mobs. Well, there you go. There you go. He didn't die. He lives. It's easy. Wait. First Dragonflight Hardcore level 60 death. Uh, so these are just like, don't stack charges. So, you guys might not be aware of this, but people do Hardcore and Dragonflight. Um, also Wrath. I'm curious to see this. I'm gonna see what happens. Um, this is, uh, in case you don't know much about retail, this is one of the dungeons. This boss is the penultimate boss of uh what's the name azur vault azur vault this is azur vault this uh what 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 key is this what what level wait is this a normal mode done is it normal mode i think this is normal mode the boss only has too many health at least that's low right just don't stand and move out of it on this one, I think she's only gonna do the the one. Yeah, we'll be. I'm gonna... Yeah, this is definitely normal. Oh yeah, mode. you don't want to be near that person, by the way. Whoever's getting icy devastator. Yeah. Wait, so does he not run in the barrier? And... Wait, which one? Not the pink one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not the DK one. Yeah, save your save your DK bubble for when the real bubble comes out, or else we get baited. Oh my god. Ah, uh, okay. Sorry. Fucking heroism. And not... Is he gonna fall off? <laughs> I'm still on cooldown, ha ha ha. I saw so how you right die now, here on normal mode. You have to just fall off. Okay. We're going. Not, gotcha. yeah, not in this situation, but like, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. I was about to say, we don't want to drop that shit where we need to stand soon. Okay. Oh. What? He just got one shot? Don't want to drop that shit where we need to stand soon. Um... Wh what happened? He fell off. Okay, the hunter disengaged? Okay, hold on. A Ashiok HC. Who is he? Like, it's so hard to tell. Dude. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> is it this guy? On the right? Or is that the monk? Yeah, I think this is him. That's that's the monk. This is him. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what happens. No, no, no. I was about to say we don't want to drop that shit where we need to stand soon. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's kind of funny though. Like, look. Like, he just like pieced it straight down there. Look, 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 look at look at this guy here. No, no, no. I was about to say we don't want to drop that shit where we need to stand soon. Okay. Oh. Oh. <gasps> First death. There you go, man. All right. What is this? Are we gonna have elevator boss? This is gonna be elevator boss, is it? No, it's actually... Oh, they pulled downstairs! They pulled downstairs! With the totem! Why would you put your totem here, dude? What are you doing? So now people are panicking. We pulled Ink WTF. Ink. OMG. 
And so it's gonna pull probably more packs. I'm not sure if even the totem pulled. There's landmines here. They explode after 10 seconds, by the way. This guy's in range of the mine. It blew up on him. Yeah, 500 damage. That's the mine. He almost died to the mines. 200 health. Now, if they didn't panic and they just killed the mines, they wouldn't lose all this healer mana. Yeah? You have so much time before the mobs arrive. How many mobs are here now? I mean, that's not that much. Oh, that's a lot. That's not that much. Ow. Yeah, they can jump back down, that's true. But they risk pulling the, the patrol. There's a patrol down there. Now there's a lot of mines. They're all immune to magic damage when that happens. The mine is still up. It's gonna go boom. It didn't hit anyone. It killed the pet though. Mike killed the pet is dead. F in the chat for Michael. Following me. The guy decided to jump down. He, the healer said jump, jump. They, like, they can't can jump. Back. He's rooted. What do you mean? You just let your boy... Look at him. He's oh, trying God. to bandage. Ah, just ditching the warriors, man. And this guy rides dumbass. Oh, he's mad at the shaman. Wait, the the hunter died too? No, he feigned, right? And now the shaman got rooted, so he's gonna die too. Yeah. Dude, three people in my fucking group just died. Really? I think the hunter yeah. died. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, he didn't die. He's still alive. Are sorry, you, sorry. My bad. Good? I fucking vanished. I'm good. <laughs> oh, no. I hate rogues, man. I'm sorry, dude. There's a, listen to this attitude. <laughs> yeah, I vanished. I'm good. Ain't no problem for me, man. Listen. It feels bad the warriors died, right? Like, I mean, this guy didn't die. Here for Wind Fury, still alive. Uh -oh. Easy for the, for the rogue. Let's watch one more. Level 54 Paladin that. This is Ungoro Crater. Oops. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and say. And I'm kind of going to gonna want a limb here, right? Um... I don't think Paladin is necessarily like the best class in the game for dealing with multiple mobs. Of course you have stuff like Consecration, but do you think it's like capable of killing two yellow mobs at this level without much issue? I'm actually just curious, you guys maybe play Paladin, I don't. Um, I don't know, at this level guys, at level 50 plus. I don't know how that goes. I, I mean, I, at lower levels, it seems fine to me. But at the higher levels, maybe you're you're suddenly not as much DPS. I don't know. I honestly don't, I have no idea until I play one. Right. So yeah, this this looks like a bad situation. He does have consecration, so he is specced into holy. Probably like red holy, right? But let's see what happens. He has four stacks, by the way. This this debuff here reduces all your armor. He has zero armor. It fell off though. Lay on hands. Um, yeah, he's holy. He has the uh, increased armor, I think. That's what it does. He puts a target dummy. Very good play from him. Um, he still has bubble available. You cannot bubble Hearthstone, by the way, chat. In case you're wondering why he's not doing that, you are not allowed to bubble Hearthstone. Is he running the wrong way? Honestly? Ah, oh, he just... You can remove that. Dispel it, dispel it, dispel it, dispel it. Dispel it. Dispel it! Why did you health pot? You should mana pot maybe. You might not have mana for bubble now. Does he not have bubble ready? Oh, he doesn't have bubble ready. Why isn't there something else that's like bubble? Or? Like Hodge. Yeah, Hodge. I mean Hodge. Pop. 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 Press, 
this ability right here. How is he not dead yet? Is beyond Bop. Bop. Hello? Please. Now you don't have mana for it. You have now. Press Bop. Why? I don't understand, man. Like, you have Bop. I mean, of course he's panicking. Listen, it's so easy to backseat. But like, Jesus. He had so much time to do it. I understand panicking. Like, I died in dead mines without bubbling. Same same problem, right? Um, but that happened in like two, three seconds. This happened over... I'd say from this point onwards, Bob would have been real good. He had so much time. Man, Paladin is actually insane though. The fact he took that much time to die is is ridiculous to me. Like I expected him to be dead way, way before that, you know? Dude, we're, you're gonna see that in classic hardcore highlights in a, probably a few days, man. That clip is gonna make the cut. Right, let me hand this in and take the flight and I can I can watch some more deaths. I'm just getting these from the Discord, by the way. They're fresh. <laughs> fresh um uh, fresh accidents. All right. Palas the safest class 11 and hardcore? I don't think so, dude. I don't think it is. It's definitely easy, though. I I'll give you that, right? I I'd say it's one of the easier classes. But not the easiest. I think Hunter, Mage, Priest, Warlock has it beat. Personally. I think those, those three have it beat. Yeah. But, I mean, the thing about Paladin that no one here can deny is they have some of the best cooldowns in the game. For, like, bad situations. I mean, you saw that lay on hands, you got bubble, and you have bop. Right? It's pretty good. Warlock has the lowest average level of all classes. I don't know if that's true for me. Um... Well, kinda, yeah, it is. It is uh, slightly. Hunter is actually lower. But we discussed this earlier. Um, so, there is definitely a correlation. And between. Okay, so. This is not meant to be toxic. Do not take this as toxicity, right? But there's people that join my chat every day. They're, they're maybe interested in trying the challenge. They have, they have no experience playing hardcore, right? And they ask me, hey, Joker, what's the easiest class to play? And I answer them, Hunter, Warlock, Priest, Mage. So then that player, first time ever playing Hardcore, picks one of those classes and will probably die before level 20. Because it's not that easy and if you've never done it before, um, you're probably going to fail. I fail as well, even with a lot of experience. So what happens is, on these easy classes, you have a lot of people that are only playing them because they're easy. And... If you're like not as skilled of a player or experience, let's not be let's be honest, it's not really skill, it's more experience, right? And knowledge. You're gonna fail. So you might have people picking shaman or warrior or some other hard class like druid. I'm, I don't know if druid's that hard. Um, because they wanna challenge themselves and they will compensate for the difficulty of the class because they're experienced. Whereas on the other hand of the spectrum, you have people picking hunter because it's easy and then they die at level nine. Look at these two guys here. Died at level 10. Died at level 11. Now, that being said... That being said... The Skullrock Cave is ridiculously challenging for any class in the game. Don't you guys agree? Hunter, Warlock, Mage... That cave is a death sentence. So, a lot of these guys go in that cave and they just die. It's like a slaughter, you know? So, it ends up being what's the most popular class to level. And that's why sometimes it has a low level... Uh, average death because they all are rolling that class and dying in the cave but there's there's so many variables we can talk about this forever right anyways um let me find our death here level 50 warrior is he gonna fall in the no 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 he... what he just auto attacked the the flight master there's not much you can do in this situation. They they they're, they're mouse, so they fly. They move fast. He clicks shield wall. He's just laughing. Look at him. Don't hit it back. Don't hit it back. Don't hit it back. Don't war stop. That's the worst ability ever made in WoW. Unless you're like a shaman. 
I swear, War Stomp is so... Remove that from your bars as a warrior, man. Trust me on this. It's such a bait ability. You get pushed back during it and it resets the leash timer. Be very careful using War Stomp, man. He could have made it out, dude, if he didn't press that. He got baited. It's such a two hands, uh, two edged sword, that, that ability, man, I swear. Slightly. <laughs> oh, no. Yo, I'm gonna go ahead and say this. I think these packs in Westfall are ridiculously unfair. Like, I don't know what you're supposed to do. Um, there's like packs between four to six mobs. It's like, how is anyone supposed to deal with these packs? <laughs> you know, like... <laughs> I always say it when I'm Westfall, I'm like, what? Like, these packs are just so over overtuned, I mean... Yeah, it's just uh, how how do you deal with that? It's like two casters, they're all high level. I don't know. Help! Sorry about that. That's the video. Don't hit it back! Don't hit it back! Don't hit it back! You're resetting the leash timer, bro. Press escape. Oh fuck, dude. Somebody needs to make a leash guide. Like a proper, not me, someone that knows exactly how it works, man. And because there's so many players that don't understand, I think. Like, they're like Tommy or something. Like, make a leash guide. It will get so many views. It will help so many people. Is there actually one? Yeah, but they don't know. They're, he's pressing demo shout. He's literally just dying because of that. Like, you do it. I don't know how to make guides. 